Hi. So, I do have some nice actual vlog footage to show, but I forgot to... Did I forget? No, I didn't forget. I lost. <laughs> Let's be honest, I lost. I think I lost some footage that I recorded for the remainder of my summer vacation, so I had to kind of improvise, and I'm just showing what I did over when, or during the summer vacation. It's also confusing because... And this, um, when I was recording the footage, I say summer vacation, but then I also mention a break. So summer vacation refers to like my actual job, right? You know, like I have to go to work. And then the break is the break that we got during the illustration class. So yeah, this, the video is all over the place. But <laughs> um, so what you're seeing now on the screen is me coloring the line art and getting the flats together. The vlog starts off with me in the middle of summer vacation and then restarting the illustration classes back up. So yeah, please enjoy. So there's a fan going, um, so, or it's off, whatever. So I don't know how the audio will be, but I thought I'd record anyway. So recently, I think every Thursday I'll go work out and then head over to karaoke, so. Yeah, it's so fun. I love going. I go like, like I said, every week, every Thursday. Um, I can't sing, but <laughs> I like to sing a lot. So I just like come over and just like practice and work on songs that I like to sing or I want to sing. And yeah, it's fun. I love like how there's private karaoke in Japan. It's it's a lot of fun. So if you're out here or even, I think they have, they've opened like a few up. Um, maybe stateside, I don't know about other countries, but I, I think they have it in Korea too. Anyway, <laughs> if you ever get a chance, like, it's it's worth it. It's a lot of fun. You have to go at least once. So I came back from karaoke and on the way I went to the convenience store and they had this. I am so happy because I had, they had these at my grocery store for like a week and I got, I think I bought like two, maybe it was two weeks, I got two and they just disappeared all of a sudden. I never got to say goodbye. So uh, I'm glad that they're, they're back. They are here. So I snagged one. Um, yeah, it's basically... It's um, typically sold as a soup, like a instant noodle soup, and that's available like all the time. And it's like super cheap. Actually, I remember um, when I was at my previous apartment and I was saving up money to move to this apartment, I had this for lunch like every day. <laughs> so I have a special relationship with this brand, but um, this is uh, right here. It says yaki udon, like one of the few things I can actually read on here, but... <laughs> But it's, um, instead of a soup, it's kind of just, like, noodles without the soup. I don't know how to explain it. It's, it but it has, like, a lot of flavor. It's a little spicy. It's so good. So I'm glad I, um, I got these. I think I'm gonna have it for dinner. And, yeah, but now I need to, I need to work. Um, this is what I have so far for my illustration for the, for the, what is it? No, Swatches Academy Fantasy Illustration. So... Um, right now, um, I have to work on doing no tan passes, like different options for lighting basically, and this is the first one. Um, we were supposed to do like a standard um, lighting from the front, and I did that, so now I have to do two other lighting. So I'm going to look at like other illustrations and other paintings and see if I can get inspiration for the other two. And yeah, that's what I'll be doing today. So I've been recording the process of this, like the screenshot, but I haven't really been talking about it. So <laughs> I thought I'd uh, just show what we did for like the last week, what I turned in for homework. So um, these are like the three ideas that I had for the colors and lighting. Um, I, I really, I wanted to do the middle one like with the sunlight, or not sun, what it sunset, but uh, yeah, they're just like, don't, don't do anything too tricky so I'm just like fine 
<laughs> I really wanted to, but um, they were just like, you know, just just listen to what we have to say. The, the, the instructors and that, the instructors. This who I'm talking about. We just had um, a critique um, earlier, or well, earlier today for me. So yeah, um, and I think they were leaning towards this one. So what I decided to do was take like the shadow bottom half of this and then use like the lighting for this. Um, and yeah, I already started working on it. So another suggestion was to bring down like the, the back and make it more of a glacier because I, no, I had no idea what I was doing for this. Um, I did, oh sorry, I just let that go real quick. Okay, so I did want to, um, I was thinking, of like an ice slash like mountain type of thing for like this this part but it was just uh, I didn't know how to really execute that so um I was suggested just to like make it um a full like glacier wall um I don't know if glacier is ice wall I'll just say ice wall <laughs> I'm just like it's glacier only for the ice on the water anyway um yeah, so I'm doing an ice wall, and then, okay, so I got, <laughs> I got, um, feedback from the last time, not this, la not this time, but, like, the last time, to make, like, the clouds like this, and then have it, like, pointing toward the character, so I tried my best, but one of the instructors, she was just like, yeah, it looked like you didn't know what you were doing for the clouds, so I'm just like, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> so she was just like just make a big cloud um and then just make like smaller clouds here so i'm just like okay so i'm gonna erase these and then just make a big cloud but <laughs> yeah still learning still out here learning um yeah so that's that's what i'll be doing today just rearranging everything and then this week we're supposed to um work on the character so yeah that's what i'll be doing this week All right, so it is 8.51 in the morning. Um, I've been on summer vacation for the past week and I have a week left. So I've been trying to do as much like recording and editing and just like working on my assignments as I can. And yeah, I wanted to show um, MetaHuman. Um, I don't know if you've heard it, but it's like a program on that's, um, uh, what am I trying to say? It's like you can use it online. Like you don't have to download it on your, onto your computer. Um, and it's powered by Unreal Engine. But <laughs> I was going to show me making the character for my illustration. But I got on this uh, landing page. And look, look how real they look. It's so... It's really creepy. <laughs> I was just... I was like going to sign in and I I don't think they had this the last time I I was on so when I I went to the site and I saw this I'm just like what in the world it's so weird how real they look anyway um I'm gonna sign in and then I'll go through the process of me making the character but oh my god there's like pores and oh my it's so weird it's so weird all right I made it so <laughs> Uh, here you have um, face, hair, and body. So I'm going to mainly just focus on the face. Um, and I want like his features combined with like the beard and everything. Um, and then like I said, try to get the angle right. So let's see what I can do.
finished result um as you can see i was able to like change the lighting it's an outside day scene and actually it's kind of perfect because i have clouds and a sky in the background so um i tried to change the lighting that's like close to what i have in my illustration so now i'm just going to like print the screen and then add it to my references it's a little later in the day around like 9 or 21 I don't know, do people say like 21? Like, I'll meet you at 21. I always like automatically convert it to 9. I've never heard anyone else say like 21 or like 23. Anyway, it's that time. Um, and I'm editing video. This is, this is so long. Like whenever I do the screen grabs or screen recordings and then I put it all together. Yeah, I think that's, that takes like the longest time. Um, but yeah, I'm going to take a break and get a snack real quick because I like to eat and work for some reason. I feel like that's a common thing too. Like people who sit at the desk like to eat for some reason. <laughs> I don't know why, but yeah, I, I feel like it just makes things go easier, go faster. Anyway. So today is a baking day. I'm so excited. Um, I'm going to make brownies and then red velvet cookies. Um, and I'll be following this recipe that I found. Uh, it's... Um... Hi, um, editing me here. So I was watching this segment back and I'm just like... I'm, I feel like I, I'm not really conveying what I want to say and just like noodling around with what I'm trying to say. Anyway, basically, it's hard to follow English and specifically like English American recipes because their measurements are different. So I prefer using Japanese res uh, recipes because it has the, um, the same measurements. Um, and as you can see, there's also grams. On top of that, the ovens are different, so I'm used to using like a gas oven, but in Japan, the, um, I think it's convec convection oven, where it's, the air circulates and heats up your food, so using recipes from Japan are much easier than following like English recipes, so that's why I'm using the site. Alright, bye. <laughs> I ended up heating up uh, the brownies that I made earlier and then put like some mint chocolate ice cream on top. Oh my god, this sounds so good. I'm so excited. It's been a while since I've had like um, cake or like brownie with ice cream. I used to have it. Well, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say a lot, but it's definitely like one of my like favorite go-to snack dessert things. So yeah, I'm eating this while I edit. And also I have this in the background for... I don't know why, but I've been recently into like crime investigation videos i guess there's like a whole community out there um i try not to watch like too much but sometimes it's it's interesting so yeah 
my my Friday afternoon. I'm so sad this is my last Friday before vacation ends, but it's going to be a good Friday anyway. The next day. This is what I love about being on vacation. I can wake up at like 3.23 if I want to and then edit videos. Um, it was between this and working on a character design, um, but I'm kind of behind on editing, so I figure I'd just do this. I want to try to get as much done before I have to go back to work. Um, with the character design, it's like it's almost finished, so I can just work on that bit by bit. Um, I think I want to have it done by the end of the week, so I think I can manage that, but yeah, I have to, there's so much I have to edit. Alright, it is 10 on a Friday morning, and this is what I have so far for my character. Um, I'm liking the way it's going so far. I had to, I think um, one thing I noticed is I made the skin too light. I actually, I, I made it darker, but... I think I made it like the highlight color or like close to it um, so I need to make it darker and then like build in the highlights like it was suggested to me so I'm gonna try that but um, yeah I, I like it so far um, I'm trying this thing where I don't have <laughs> any like shows or like movies or anyone like talking in the background but I did have like this playing um, someone's like working on this uh, this painting it's really long too it's like 14 hours so i just have it in the background um just to like give me motivation i haven't really heard of this person actually i keep meaning to look them up on instagram i'm gonna do that after i uh film this but yeah uh golem pretty good and then i have the halo soundtrack playing in the background another tip um i've heard is like to put video game music or like um movie scores in the background instead of like um, music with lyrics so I'm trying <laughs> it's hard I, I listened to a couple of songs in the middle of this but um, yeah Halo the music they did for it was really good so I have um, just like a collection all the way from one I think this uh, I'm not gonna scroll all the way down there I think it might go to like five or something but anyway yeah that's what I am doing this morning you've made it to the end of the vlog Yay! <laughs> Uh, thank you so much for watching. Yeah, I, I still don't really have a grasp on the concept of finishing a vlog while I'm still vlogging, so please forget the voiceover. But anyway, uh, like I said, thank you so much for tuning in. Um, and watch out for the next one where I start to just like bring everything together. There's two more weeks left um, with the course. So um, yeah, like I said, look out for those coming out soon. Uh, but with that, I am signing off and I will see you in the next one. Peace.